Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can see by the title today, I will be doing my two week update on this little beauty here. So before I start the review and all that fun stuff, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl down below. And yeah, let's get started. All right, so the wig that I've been wearing for the past couple of days is the Sensational Empress Italian Curl. And yeah, if you guys didn't see my initial review, definitely go check that out now and then come back to this one. But anywho, so basically, like I said before in my initial review, this is, I've bought this wig, I would say like three or four times already. So I already know how it is and I already know how it acts and all that fun stuff. So basically, like I said in my initial review, this hair does get big with time and it looks a bit more natural as the curls kind of go from being those perfect ringlets to being a little bit more frizzy and bigger. So as you guys can see, it did definitely get big. Now this is all the hair pulled to the front. And like I said before, this is about how long it is. So it's not crazy, crazy long compared to the other units that I've been wearing so far on my channel. But it's a decent length. I mean, with all the hair up in this area, you don't really want a super long curly wig as well. Because it's just like, eh, I feel like it'll just be a little too much. But long story short, when it comes to tangling, I do not finger comb this hair whatsoever. So of course, if I were to try to run my hands through it, it would be a tangled hot mess just because it's curly hair. So that's a no, but tangling, I'm pretty sure that there's tangling. I mean, it's a curly unit. It's to be expected, especially after wearing it every day for two weeks. Then when it also comes to shedding, again, I don't roll my hands through the hair, so I don't experience any shedding with this wig whatsoever. Initially, just a tiny bit when I first cut the lace, but again, that's to be expected. So tangling and shedding is definitely a pro when it comes to this wig because it is a curly unit. So moving on with the cons, yes, this unit gets big with time and to me I like it like it's enjoyable but that after a while it gets a little bit annoying just because of the simple fact that like my hair is always I feel like it's always in my face like I feel like I always have to move it to the side to get out my face and that's like the one thing that I don't like about the hair after a while especially because like it just ends up doing that like there's a couple times actually where like I kept doing this and my eyelashes ended up popping off because the hair kept getting like intertwined with the lashes and it's just not a good look whatsoever also when it does come to this hair if you're the type of person that likes to do like a full face of makeup on a regular basis this hair might get a little bit annoying just because of the fact that again it does get in your face a lot like a lot throughout the day after it like even just now I felt a little snag on my eyelash so like, you gotta be real you gotta be like this when you kind of move it to the back to make sure that you're not really affecting anything now for me as some of you guys may have saw from my other videos prior like when I did my eyeshadow looks and stuff basically all I do is because I have to wear my wig and then do my makeup I can't do a full face of makeup and then plop my wig on because then the hair is just gonna get mixed with the, your foundation and then it's just not a cute look so basically I'll plop that wig on first and then what I'll do is I'll just grab two bobby pins and then I'll just slick it back like this. It doesn't have to be perfect whatsoever, but I'll basically slick it back like this and then slick my hair back like this. And then for the most part, as you guys can see, it's out of my face. So that's basically how I do a full face of makeup wearing this wig. So it's not impossible. It's just a little extra that you have to do again you can make this hair as big as you want to make it again i wouldn't initially try to make it look like this the first day because again it does just naturally get bigger and bigger with time but again if you're the type of person that loves big curly hair do you but yeah that's pretty much it i probably this is probably not the shortest video i've ever uploaded just because again like there's really not that much to say again it gets bigger tangling and shedding is a bare minimum because again, why am I gonna be running my fingers through it and stuff? But like loose strands of hair don't be popping off during the day and all that weird stuff. So that's a plus. The only con I would say is that this hair does get bigger over time and it starts to become a little bit annoying and a little bit overwhelming, especially if you're the type of person that likes to do your makeup. So yeah, that's pretty much it. If I didn't, if I forgot to touch on anything or if you guys had any initial questions, initial questions, additional questions, please don't hesitate to comment down below. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next one.